no settling down. My text go to screen, you know better than that. I come around when you least expect me. I'm sitting at the bar when your class is empty. You thinking that the song's coming on and What's going on, Clay and Fan? Back at it again with some more NBA 2K23 My Era's gameplay. Now, I had a comment on the last video. And let me read that off to you real quick. This is from Sergio Garcia, and the comment reads, Yo, my dude, just so you know, for the role-playing elements, it's in the overview section. You get tasks and then complete those tasks to get experience and unlock skills to talk to players and staff in the my gm skills section all right so here's a list of things coach game plan all this stuff here's our tasks get the team to at least three veterans on the roster all right we can do that logan mills the assistant head coach says i want to make sure that we're still buzzing in social media well social media doesn't exist so i'm not going to make a promise actually i'm going to express doubts that should definitely be possible. We have some great games coming up. We don't have social media. Social media has yet to be invented. I'd like you to get some more draft picks for the coming draft. I can do that, coach. Sure. We should flip one of our expirings for some assets. Let's move either Charlie Chris or Tremont Goodwin. There are some big free agents shaping up. You need to clear up some cap space. You got it. So that guy wants us to get to 25 million in cap room. We have a 4.64 total salary, so 2K, you uh, you kind of drop the ball on that. You drop the ball on these little tasks that these guys are giving us. Um, how about you give us tasks that are possible? Okay? Maybe uh, maybe you'll get that fixed by next year. I don't know. We'll simulate up to uh, the trade deadline, see how the team's doing. So far, we're 21 and 19. That's not that's not terrible. I figured it was going to be a lot worse than that. We're seventh right now in the West. We're 12 games back from first place, but we could possibly make the playoffs. All right, season over. We kept fan interest above 60%. That's good. We lose more than 42 games. We only lost 37. So there you go. Magic Johnson wins the MVP, Rookie of the Year. Kima Lajuan. What a beast. 23 and 13. Wow. Darren Willis, Sixth Man of the Year. He's not a real person. Keem wins Defensive Player of the Year. Fat Lever wins Most Improved. Brad Nelson, Coach of the Year. Who's he coach? He coaches the Lakers. Wilson Thorpe, Executive of the Year for the 76ers. Good for him. Here are the first team, second team, third team, All-NBA. Hakeem makes first team. MJ makes second team. We're, we're in good shape. MJ is feeling lit. We finished 22 games behind the Lakers. Man, the Lakers are so good. And the Celtics are so good. Game one, we lose. Who do they have on their team? They probably have Clyde Drexler. Yeah. Game two goes to them. I'm not expecting us to win this series, to be honest. We did tie it up, and we've been eliminated. Okay. And the other good thing is it's five games, which I think is how, how it really was uh, at that point. And it's the Lakers and Celtics again. The Lakers win back-to-back -back NBA championships. Magic Johnson has won two straight finals MVPs. Time for our historic changes. Let's see. The top seven picks are done via random weighted draw. Remaining lotto picks are determined by team record. Okay. Team odds will be based only on team record. No standings rules for draft lottery. What? Rule change the four worst teams will have identical odds of obtaining a top three pick. Okay. Team branding. The Kansas City Kings will relocate to Sacramento. The Lakers are changing their floor. The Nuggets are changing their floor and uniforms. The Bulls are changing their uniforms. It looks like the Supersonics are probably going to get Patrick Ewing. Chris Mullen is the number one pick? Really? Patrick Ewing goes to the San Antonio Spurs. Who are the Knicks going to take? Joe Dumars? Bulls take Carl Malone? Good God, man. Why does he look so old? Mario Ellie, welcome to the team, bro. Mario Ellie did play for the Rockets. He was a part of uh, that championship team. Back-to-back -back championships in 94 and 95. So there we go. I still can't believe Chris Mullen was the number one pick. Why? Why would they pick him? We have five shooting guards. We, yeah, we gotta, we gotta do something about that. We'll take these picks. Jim Paxson is eating our salary up. Larry Nance? Let's do that. Paul Westfall and Larry Nance for Jim Paxson. And we're eating way less salary. 
Yeah, let's do that. That's a great trade. George Johnson? Sure. George Johnson. He's one of the all-time greats. Look at this guy. Dude, I gotta sign this guy. Look at him. If you had to pluck somebody out of the mid-1980s, this would be the quintessential guy. Like, if you were like, oh, I just, I just found somebody. He just came out of a time capsule. What time period is he from? 1985? I would expect him to look exactly like this guy. All right, we got Lionel Hollins, and we got Rich Kelly, baby. All right, we're set. Team needs have been met. MJ's up to a 90. Oh my. Hakeem's up to an 88. We got Larry Nance at the four, Craig Elo at the two. We got Hollins and Westfall. Westfall's fallen off. We might be pretty good. We could get Doc Rivers. 82 overall point guard. Welcome to the team, Doc. Welcome to the team. Magic Johnson wins the MVP again. Car Malone, rookie of the year. Okay, stop showing me my tasks. I don't I don't care. Byron Scott, sixth man of the year, playing with the Lakers. Keem, defense player of the year again. Jay Humphreys, most improved. Brad Nelson, coach of the year, of course. Ken Adams. Let's freaking go, Ken Adams. Executive of the year, just like he should be. That's what I'm talking about. Magic Johnson's injured. Broken right leg, he's out for two to four weeks. That might open up the West. The West might have just opened up. We were still 11 games back. Magic Johnson being injured might be the only way we, uh, we get this thing done. Detroit still just slowly creeping up on the Boston Celtics. Well, here we go. Round one against the L.A. Clippers. Game one goes to us. Let's see who they got on their team. Ricky Pierce, Ed Pinckney, Craig Hodges. Simulate game two. We win. We just need to win one more. And we get the sweep. Let's go, Nuggets. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. So now we got the Seattle Sonics. Let's see who they got on their squad. They got number one pick, Chris Mullen, Jack Sigma, Tom Chambers, we should beat this team. Win game one. Win game two. Win game three. Win game, we swept them. We swept them. And we are going to be playing the Dallas Mavericks, who have Mark Aguirre, uh, Ronaldo Blackman, Ronaldo Blackman, Rolando Blackman, Dale Ellis, Derek Harper. Uh, this team might be pretty good and they got Charles Oakley and they got Wayman Tisdale Ooh! oh the Celtics got beat too this championship is ours for the taking oh my god and we lose game one come on fellas let's go no man no man oh my god how did we lose to that team what we got Michael Jordan and Akeem Olajuwon, man. Give me a break. Man, that sucks. This was our year to do it, and we lost. We choked. All right, so team branding. The Bucks are changing their floor and uniforms, and the Golden State Warriors are changing their uniforms. Cool. The Chicago Bulls get the number one pick in the 1986 NBA draft. Do we have a pick? We do not. All right, we'll, we'll find a way to get Dennis Rodman. I just don't know how we're going to get into the lottery. That's going to be hard. Who has the next pick? The Pacers? Yeah, we'll give you a couple of first-rounders. All right, there we go. Cool. So now we get Dennis Rodman. This team, I mean, this team is going to be just ridiculous. Come on, man. Is the Rockets' selection of Dennis Rodman any indication of what they think their chances are of re-signing free agent Larry Nance? No, I didn't even think about that. Larry Nance will come back. What's Rodman rated? Rodman's a 74. That's not bad. He'll progress. Larry Nance just took all of our money. Can we get something out of him? He's taking up $930,000 a year. That's a lot of money. Oh my god, we got 269 overalls in our... F oh no. We cannot be having that. George Johnson, I'm sorry dude, but we gotta get rid of you. Daryl Walker and Clement Johnson. We're gonna go ahead and take them. Again, no freaking clue who... I don't even think he's a real person. I think he's just a made-up guy. Yeah, for sure he's a made-up guy. But we needed a point guard, so whatever. Let's take a look at these tasks real quick. I think this is our year. It's time to win the whole thing. 
Governor Travis Harden, I 1 million percent agree. We're going to win the NBA championship this year. Let's freaking do it right now. This is going to be the end of the video right here. We're simulating. Well, first. Yeah, no, I'm not worried about contract extensions. We're simulating to the end of the year. Let's win the NBA championship. Magic Johnson, MVP once again. Ron Harper, Rookie of the Year. Sixth Man of the Year, Clark Kellogg with the Hawks. Akeem, once again, Defensive Player of the Year. Most Improved, Hot Rod Williams. Brad Nelson, Coach of the Year. Ken Adams, once again, Executive of the Year. This guy can't miss. He cannot miss. We're the four seed. And I don't think Magic Johnson is injured this year. He is not. All right, we win game one. Win game two. Win game three. All right, we got the Lakers. I will say this. We got this going for us. They replaced Kareem Abdul-Jabbar with Bill Walton. That could be a good thing. Game one. Okay, that's fine. They got home court advantage, whatever. We win game two. Oh, man. Okay, we win game four. Come on, boys. Come on, boys. Oh, my goodness. All right, here we go. God, man, why is this team losing, bro? Oh, what a surprise. Lakers, Celtics in the finals. Oh, my God, man. Enough of this. Enough of the Lakers and the freaking Celtics, man. Like, these guys are getting old. God, Magic's only 27 years old. Never mind. Uh, God. Well... That's going to do it for me for this episode. I'm frustrated. There's no reason that we should have lost that. There is no reason that we shouldn't have won the NBA championship. No reason at all. Can I just look at this team real quick? Look at this team. Michael Jordan, Akeem, Daryl Walker, some random, Dennis Rodman. Oh, Larry Nance was hurt. Broken vertebrae. No wonder we lost. Larry Nance broke his neck. See you guys on another time. Peace. You fucker.